What is going on? There's a new difficulty and I want to try it. Back with the community. God damn it, I pressed the bomb. <laughs> what is going on with you? You some kind of Himalacria guy. You look really cool. Back with the community remix mod. I mentioned before that I wanted to try the insane mode that it adds. And I know for the original community remix, it also had an insane mode. And so far, this version of community remix adds a lot of things but stays faithful. So I'm led to believe. Oh yeah, yikes. Definitely don't want that. I'm led to believe that this is kind of the same thing. Now, I could be wrong. I literally have no idea idea what insane mode even does for me but we're just gonna roll with it emulation a sacrifice to our lord i don't know what this does maybe i uh, press q and i take damage and i hurt everyone actually i'm going to the curse room that's actually interesting i'm surprised there isn't a curse room tp in the game hp and tears up from both experimentals that's kind of fantasy land type stuff but i'm happy it happened so, I remember in Flash Community Remix, Insane Mode made it so that you only have a 33% chance to get a shop or a treasure room, as well as a 40% less chance to get any kind of deal. You know, I don't see too many new uh, champions, room layouts seem somewhat the same, so I'm thinking this might just be the case, and I might just be really lucky on the first floor. Oh, that's right, I forgot about that. Also on Insane Mode, unlike when you're at the womb and you start taking full hearts of damage, uh, every hit of damage on insane mode is immediately one full heart of damage there are no half hearts you can still pick up you know half red hearts but all damage will be one full red heart and so it's gonna be pretty tough to keep your hp afloat if you keep getting hit thanks for the golden key i don't think it's too useful though I don't know about you, but the way I kind of skirted into place there made me feel like I was a movie action hero. And I know that's within the context of The Binding of Isaac, which makes that even less impressive. But for me, I like I just did it another time. I, I felt so sick just now. <laughs> you can't tell me that wasn't at least a little bit sleek. One more time. Oh, hello, Dangle. Uh, does this guy have more HP or something? I, I don't know. I feel like I've been shooting him for a while. Maybe I'm just crazy. On top of treasure rooms and shops having a 33% chance to show up, I believe in the Flash version might apply here. We won't know until it happens, though. There's only a 33% chance that bosses drop items as well. Oh, I guess also Squeezy only has half hearts. Maybe it's not like Flash. Maybe it's more just like its own thing. I gotta find out. We gotta learn. Let's go. Either way, I need to get in the mindset of insane mode. I can't be taking random hits anymore. Every hit is a full heart. I cannot mess around. It doesn't seem like deal chance is reduced. Maybe when I did my research on the old version of insane mode, and by research I mean I looked up an old YouTube video, uh, that information was outdated, who knows. Things are looking dire, but I'm sure I can bring it back. Just gotta find a couple hearts. World's most obvious secret room into more cash and a potential curse room. I want to go in here, honestly. I don't have enough money for the shop. Hey, ooh, hello. Do I really want to do something like this on insane mode day? I kinda do, I don't know, ooh, not so great. I wanted to go in the curse room because I don't have the most cash, and I feel like it's the only way that I could ever get in there with double damage, especially with my health. I feel like I'm gonna regret this. Oh, eh, actually that's great. Things are dire, so a one-up can save my life. Let's go with it. Lil Blub time. Easy fight. I'm coping 100%. I'm gonna get hit, guys. I don't even have that much damage. I'm like three-shotting the leeches. I have base. It turns out insane mode is the enemies we made along the way. No jumps. I've been really lucky trying to keep back all these leeches. Wait, what? I n never noticed that. What the hell? I did not know that Draws Blub and Downpour Blub play differently. This guy's doing that weird tear effect, and when he jumps, he does a splash, but it's not like the- Oh, no, never mind. Never- I, yeah, I spoke too soon. <laughs> I thought I literally entered the Matrix, I'm not gonna lie. I thought I solved the Binding of Isaac in that moment. Game Theory would have to compete with me. Not the case, but I somehow didn't get hit. On base damage blub, so I will commend myself for that. We did get the deal, but I am not interested, I don't have a roll. I wanna go to the shop, I think. A little blasphemous, I feel. But buying a red heart might just be the play I need. I'm not too sure what Benadryl does to this point. Do I have anything to roll? I could battery. Battery gaming time? I don't want to see a single comment talking about how I walked into wall thinking there was a hole there. 
What am I gonna get? Wait, I took the item. Oh, I took one of. Oh man, I guess I'll roll this. Oh, yay! Okay, okay, that works. Hold on. I'm bringing it back. Not to mention Mark is a black heart. Used to be a soul heart. That didn't really make sense and it took way too long to fix that. But we are where we want to be. Oh, wow. If I knew the devil would have stayed open, I maybe... Nah, I wouldn't have. Let's be honest. I wouldn't have done that. Angels for life! <laughs> I was about a bomb right here, as well as a restock and a secret room. Didn't expect that, but nice. Undeniable high value bomb, extra three cents. We blew up the keeper already. Sorry about your twin brother. It has just business. You know how it is. Now I gotta go spawn God. Clog, get out of my toilet, man. Oh, yikes. <laughs> Took some heavy damage there. Hopefully I don't take another hit. I mean, I'm thinking about it and I'm unironically literally two hits from death. And I'm really putting into perspective just how tense I've been playing this game this entire time. I am on edge, man. This actually is really hard. Please don't be magic skin. This is perfect. Wonderful. Wonderful. Thank you. I will also fight the angel 100%. I should have taken the soul heart just yet. If I had the opportunity, I would have avoided it the entire fight and taken it after. But maybe I just play undeniably good. Freakishly well. And I don't lose it. And I roll the key piece and it doesn't become magic skin. Really enjoying a lot of insane mode so far. Uh, I'm definitely enjoying it now. <laughs> oh, oh my god, you see the holy light? Oh my god, I just comboed this guy. Oh, that last one hit though. Blue beat, that sucks, my bad. Eternal heart. Do I want a soul heart? This is a, a rare time where I think this is a valuable pickup. Something I love about playing new modes is it really changes how you play. I'm gonna take Mom's Pearls, dude. Range means I can play more defensive. Luck means that Holy Light procs more. And the Soul Heart, a full Soul Heart, is invaluable to me right now. I need to stock up all of my hearts. Because I'm sure as we progress, this is only gonna get harder. Bada bing, bada boom. It's time to roll you into me. And I may be lazy, but I don't want to lose. So it's time to go and redo the level. Saw a comment asking, hey Matt, if you're just gonna rewind time anyway, why do you freak out so badly when you lose a run and die? Uh, my answer to you is, of course I'm gonna freak out and die because I know one day from now, 1,000 people minimum will say two words to me and I'm just gonna have to hold that. <laughs> There's no counterplay. It's a GG situation. Unironically checkmate. It's over, dude. Well, we got our treasure room this time, and instead I'm rewarded with magic skin. But 8-inch nails is here to stick it to him and make up for magic skin's uh, annoyingness. That's right, I called you annoying. Get out of here. Guys, think I'm hitting boss rush today? <laughs> think if I really go fast, we might be able to. Another HP up. I'm stacking them up. Less items. My ass, dude. Come on, brother. Ain't nothing you can do against me. We find this time Wormwood. This guy's a clown. I'm sending you back to Clown Town. You see the leeway there? That was a little bit sick nasty by me. I'm not even gonna lie. I'll roll this and get a range up. Okay, definitely not as good this time. I had to summon my inner PUBG for that one. Calculated and concerned. I saw the vision. I literally saw the line. It was the perfect line. 112, baby. That's right, 112. The ultimate line. It was the one. Later, idiot. Plus some leeches, plus some speed. Honestly, speed's valuable here. Higher value than most people would give credit. I say most, but I'm sure people aren't stupid. They know that speed's good here. But whatever, it's really good and I'm digging it. And I'm rolling this, because what good do I have for a handle? I'd rather get a black hole and suck everyone up. Here we go. What? What? <laughs> Guys, I found a new mode. It's Vine Boom mode. Is that what is that? Is that something to do with the like the Vine Boom mod that I have, or is that is that insane mode? <laughs> I actually can't tell. That was way too immersive. Well, I guess a part of insane mode is sometimes you just don't get to have the bombs that you thought you earned. How about a shop? Hi, greed. I feel like it's been a while since I've seen your face. Approximately 24 hours, but you know, it's been long enough. I do miss you. We should go on a date sometime. Nice, another freebie curse room. I don't even have to use my bone heart. Higher deal chance, blank rune. I'm gonna bank that this is a per throw because the amount of times that this has happened is quite flabbergasting, honestly. Also, another dice room? Are they more popular on insane mode? It's four pips, so it's useless to me. That's okay, though. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just saying the likelihood that I land at 18 0.1% angel deal. Go inside, fight the angel, press Q, and get a Perthro Sacred Heart. It's more than happened before. And with my current coin count, I feel like luck is on my side. 
Bye, Dad. Is that spoiler? I don't know that's spoiler. Whatever, that's not spoiler. Blind magic skin. I forgot you were a factory, goddammit. Can I please get something good? Would it be insane mode if I decided to be a little scary cat and not take the four heart blind devil deals? Boom. Ceremonial. Okay, I like it. As well as Incubus. That is large. As well as, well, it's a one heart deal. Perthro? No, that is uh, the the one that no one cares about. The what? Who cares? Hagala? Who, I'm taking it. Voodoo pin. Phantom paints. That's new. What? What do you do? Phantom. That it doesn't say. I don't know. <laughs> well, that is what I said earlier. I, I do really like the fact that I I don't get to know. I just have to figure it out. So uh, let's go and figure it out. It's seeming as if insane mode has no hold against me. Also, also holy light. Okay, all right. Maybe I'll give holy light a bit more credit. Oh, hello. That's great. Tractor beam. Massive tears up. Massive range up. Bit of a shot speed up. But the effect itself is where the real juice comes in. Can you stop showing up, please? I'm trying not to yell because I'm recording this at midnight. Because I just got done playing Baldur's Gate 3 and I've been having a lot of fun with that game. But now that I'm recording later, I don't want to wake people up because I don't want to be a bad person. I, get, I just get so emotional with this game. <laughs> can't, can't hold that dog back. I got that dog in me, you know what I mean? I, I can't hold it back. Maybe the super secret room shall satiate me. Oh my god, it will. Hold on. We all know what's about to happen. I'm about to wake up everyone in the house and it doesn't matter because who cares? I'm about to find the best sprite ever. Here we go. I I'll also play this a bit. Oh wow, every play is a full heart as well. That is tough. Okay, I'm gonna stop there then. Please? Ooh. I'm thinking maybe, but we gotta commit. If it wasn't insane mode, I'd get twice the amount of plays on that blood bank, and I feel like it's almost guaranteed I would get an IV or a blood bag. But these are the cards we're dealt with, so let's deal with them. Oh, okay. Bit of a lucky secret room. Leads into the cursed room. A judgment has me a little concerned. Because now I just want to focus purely on rolling the secret room. I also don't know what these do. I know what immolation does. Takes me to a cursed room. Don't need this. And worship. Devote thine flesh and soul. You guys want to guess what this does? I bet you it takes us to the sacrifice room. But there's nothing. So it's going to be a nev. What the hell? It's a spawn an item? For free? Or just like because I feel like I maybe just nerfed myself. There's no way you just get to spawn an item what kind of dream are we living in that's no there's no way i must have nerfed myself somehow uh, i'm just gonna leave because i'm not sure who or what to trust trust no one i don't believe it maybe uh something will happen when i fight this boss but okay let's just fight the cage lock in our uh, boss item maybe a deal oh okay this is what we needed i needed this so i can heal up go to the mob challenge room and uh do i have enough oh my god i barely do no way i don't <gasps> i need to go to the mob challenge room so i can charge my d6 Wait, it is open. Okay, we're fine. I'm gonna lose the bone heart for this, but I think it's worth cool stuff. Let's head back to the secret room. Yeah, the secret room, I think. Pop the judgment, I think, as well. Because if there were any time to do it, it would be now. I just have to hope it's a coin beggar. It is, and I definitely have the funds for it. Okay, things are starting to pick up, I believe. Here we go. Now we just press space bar. Oh! Okay, that's good. Nice. We'll take the death certificate. What is the game winning? I'm not even gonna decide to do this. I'm just taking brimstone. It is the item I want, especially balls. Always a fun item to take and partake in. So with that, I'll be taking my nice old brim and uh, leaving. And I'm gonna go kill my mom. Oh, God damn it, man. Everywhere I look, I see its face. Oh, wow. Allows item to tap. What the hell? Allows Isaac to take shop items for free. We got the golden store credit. I didn't know the golden credit does something, but I suppose it has a chance to turn back into the regular store credit and then remove itself. So I've just gone and unlocked free everything. This is like if you walked into a Walmart, showed them like the government god ID and were like, I'm sorry, but I need hot Cheetos right now. It's a matter of government agency. The world could and reroll you that's more like it i wish i had that kind of power are you kidding me hot cheetos on command <laughs> that would be an insane power curse room how you doing check check a little bit of hearts is not the worst it's actually pretty good i'll take it if i find any more items on the floor which i really hope i do we do almost have some form of infinite rerolls with the golden store credit along with the restock i have not been using restock despite my high money count 
I just haven't found a reason to. But at this point, I'm probably going to be forced to just to get some form of value out of it. Those red hearts are so essential. And I can only imagine that when you get that kind of super secret room while playing on this mode, it is an absolute godsend. Ah, uh, wow. I mean, there's nothing else to roll, is there? No way I'm playing a sack room. Uh, let's just roll the shop itself, I guess. Wow, okay, I found it. <laughs> Golden teleport didn't even disappear. So I can just continue to do this and do this and do this. <laughs> what? Oh, it's birthrighted. I should wait for a sec. I don't want red stew. It's gonna run out by the time I beat the entire thing. Hello, Chaos. All right, it's finally gone. And Restock just comes in out of nowhere, hitting me with the biggest 57 cent Vine Boon ever. I could put down these magic skins, though. Those will be free. What does this do? It's uh, called Clay Dreidel. Winner takes all. Man, I, I kind of want that. But I don't have the money. There's, again, blood bags. I just don't have the cash. I, I have blood banks. I just don't know if it's gonna be enough, man. I can't play them, it's too risky. Maybe? I cannot believe it. It's actually gonna happen. I didn't think it would come down to this, but I'm gonna play the sack room. I could have done the blood banks, but I got kind of lazy, I'm not gonna lie. But uh, all right, never mind. That was not as suspenseful as I wanted to make that out to be. <laughs> I got my answer two seconds in. I was crazy the amount of chance for that to happen. I might as well just go for the angel item. There's three more coins. If I was even more scared, I should get a roll before I touch that. I might go to the angel. Hold on. Firstly, let's just take you. Coconut milk. I'm sorry. It's an active item. I didn't know this. Boom. What? <laughs> what? Uh, is it crooked penny twice? And I hit the roll maybe? I... I think that might be it? I've just gone and broken it. Okay, give me bird's eye. Lord knows I'm confused. Do I want any of these? There's Damocles. I know you guys want me to take that. I'll take the tiny planet and then of course I'll take it. Please don't mess me up. You little retro vision pill, you little goober, get out of here. What did that do? Was it a crooked penny? I don't want to do any more. I'm just going to keep battering, I think, until I get something good. So let's just do this. I see, I see Sacred Heart. I didn't- I'm sorry, but like I didn't see it until the very end and I wasn't sure. But it's right there for some reason. Why did this turn into a breaking run? Is Pact good enough? Are any of these good enough? Sw well, Swarm is good enough when I'm running Damocles. Now the fact that I got the 1-up makes way more sense. It was because it was gonna be a Damocles run. Pop for a bit of synergies is nice. Do I care about the rest? Pact is the most interesting, but even that I don't care about. Roll again. Where? Give me the saw. What is that? That's a new item. I need to know. Oh, wait. Is that Max's head? It is. Oh, it's Max's head, dude. This is a flash item, man. Whoa, that's old. That's cool to find. I'm still dancing. So is there another quality four? Is it that mushroom that I don't know? No, that's a quality zero. Evil up plus all stats down. In what world would you take that? Oh, Lamau, it's because of the Abyss. Ah, Abyss, you're so silly. Thinking you're important and all. Alright, more roll time after we secure a bookworm. Can't believe this is happening. What a day. Oh my god. Very lucky with how many items have been turning into magic skin as well. It's just not as much as I would have thought. This is a new weird astrology planetarium item. It says pins and needles. I don't know if this will work with brim, but it's new, so I'll take it. Thank you very much. The rest of these I don't care too much about. Boom, roll again. This time we got satanic, some guppy. Our key's right there. I didn't even see you. But in reality, do I care about any of these? The best thing would be the, the void. But nah. Rolls are fun. Pact made to its grand return somehow. Nine volts gonna be good for me later on as well as an extra battery right now. Contract for the future? Nah, I don't need that. Let's just roll. I told you, you can't, you can't help it. I got that dog in me. You see Polyphemus? There's something in the brain. It goes off. You can't stop me. We got Botfly as well, which I think I'll take. Avoiding all versions of Damocles in all timelines. This thing will not hit me. Conjoined is cool. We get Battery and Infestation. Battery definitely. Roll of these. Mom's Eye and something pretty useless. But, it, you know, an orbital is okay. Thank you very much. Wow. Um, what just happened to my run? <laughs> I am 50 minutes in, only now beating mom, and I am so broken. Insane mode my ass, I have destroyed you. Negative for some damage, Terra Cloth is great. I'll also take, uh, well I already have Beelzebub, but I'll take it anyway, because I feel confident. I didn't really expect today to be the uh, Sacred Heart, Brimstone, Polyphemus, Sci-Fi, God run, but I'm very happy it happened. 
What? Oh, uh, my bad. Dog bone was trying to tell me about a crawl space. Hello. Anything cool or interesting in here? Hey, that's the completion of my uh, conjoined progress. Just, just kidding. I'll get it later. Sorry. My, my bad. <laughs> my bad on that one. <laughs> Hello, finally here. What is going on? Spelunky into... Hey, I mean, I'd rather take uh, the HP, actually. Thanks, though. It lives, it dies, it gives me perfection. Plus a devil room. Oh, man. Is there... Are there more of these worm things? <laughs> Where, where are you guys coming from, man? The hell, dude? What's going on? I'm hella confused. Get out of my game. Got the boss. Got a super secret room on deck. What do you have for me? More HP. At this point, we don't even need it. Give me normal mode. Give me hard mode. Give me insane mode. Give me super ultra mega deluxe ongo gongo mode. Giga ultra plus R. x version. <laughs> and there is nothing you can do to stop me with a build like this. Got a couple deals to check here. We are blind, so I'm only looking for two heart deals. But you get none of them. Which means I'm gonna start rolling and spend all my HP for it because there's no way to know. And this is how we're gonna get conjoined back. Bombo is back after I murdered his ass. We can roll this and get ladder. Pretty useless. The worms are becoming violent now. I don't know how to satiate them, guys. I'm sorry. They just keep coming directly after me. They never die. They're invulnerable. They make the most obnoxious sound ever and they somehow multiply asexually. It's quite a marvel, honestly. <laughs> What is going on here? I know one of these are dead cat. Do I want dead cat? No. I want something even better. HP, little chest, unicorn stump. Definitely 100% an utter disappointment. Oh, okay, we're doing you. Already got death certificate, but there's still some good secret room items to be had. I don't know why every single chest you give me needs to be a spike chest, and then every single time I decide to open it, it needs to be an HP up. I'd appreciate maybe a little bit less trollage on your game, but you know, if this is what you want to do, then this is what we're doing, I guess. D7 roll again. This must be an item I picked up that I didn't understand. Like, maybe that dreidel thing is like, every single thing is a spike chest now. I refuse to believe otherwise. Okay, I don't know what's going on, guys. Seriously, I don't. I'm gonna roll with it, but I, I don't understand. If every single room has a spike chest, I'm not gonna live by the time I get to the boss. I will die. I haven't even proc Damocles yet. I'm just gonna die. Mr. Me? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, we can use this. We can definitely use this. Let's open up Mega Shan. Thanks, Mr. Me. We'll take back our D6. I guess we can continue to try rolling it. I, uh, not too confident. There are so many spike chests, and I don't know what's causing it. It's definitely something I committed to earlier in the run or, or something. But I'm gonna have to stop taking them at this point, because, uh, my health is actually a little too low. I know, absurd to say, but it's true. I have my limits, and I'm scared, okay? I suppose I do also have 11 luck, so that's maybe contributing to why I just have so many chests. We do get to kill Lamb immediately right here. Very good stuff. I'll say no to the victory lap, and then let's go and roll. Bada bing, bada boom. Hello to fish hook. A tears and shot speed up. Now I think we clutch out the mega Satan fight. We got five hits. It's okay. I'm sure we'll be good. Our damage is immaculate. I just need one shot per wave, and it's completely over if I get that shot off. And even then, all my shots trickle over to different ways. Okay, it's just, it's so over. My goodness gracious, my damage. One up my ass. The one up was only for Damocles, which I didn't even proc, I don't think. I mean, I had perfection, so it couldn't have. Mega Satan done. Do I get Delirium today? I do. One final thing to do. I had my mic muted, but I found him. I'll probably get hit here, but I don't really think it matters. No way Damocles drops within like one second. There goes perfection. There goes my hit, but I should be okay. Just play as if I'm tainted lost. Nice, it's over. Delirium is done. Insane mode is conquered. Community remix is awesome. I'm glad you guys watched the video. I hope you had a good time and GG's.